All right, a lot of you guys have been asking about it today. So here is a quick global top grossing update for the new uh, Super Saiyan 2 Goku and Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta Dual Dokkan Fest. As you can see, we are on Sensor Tower, which is a great website for checking app data. And we are actually doing surprisingly well. Given how many people told me that they were skipping these banners, I'm actually very, very surprised about how many countries are almost at number one top grossing. Now, of course, we're going to start here with the savior of global, everybody's favorite region, France. And as you can see on the iOS side of things, France has already reached number one top grossing in the iOS store, which is amazing. And of course, we're sorted by today, May 8th, 2020. France, all categories. Now, this is very, very important. I've seen a lot of people uh, posting screenshots or sending me screenshots of Dokkan being number one top grossing in a lot of different regions, right? But they always sort by like games or more specifically like puzzle games or something like that. And you gotta realize that while that's great, it doesn't really count towards anything as far as top grossing rewards in Dokkan are concerned. So you have to look at all categories. It's overall top grossing, not just top grossing games or anything like that. Anyways, all categories, France today number one in the iOS store, which means that we are at least guaranteed maybe seven stones if we're basing off the past couple of top grossing rewards. I feel like seven stones, maybe 14 stones is most likely what we're gonna get, but that's only if the situation remains as it is, all right? Because there are a bunch of other regions out there on the iOS side, once again, that are getting pretty close. So next up, we have Portugal, which is at number three right now. And of course, if they manage to beat out Tinder and also this Garena Free Fire game, which I, I don't know what it is. If we can beat out these two in Portugal, then that's also another region that's hit top grossing, very, very close. Of course, the more regions that hit top grossing, generally speaking, the better our rewards, right? And also we have the US, which is at number two right now behind YouTube for some reason. I guess a lot of people are subscribing to YouTube Premium. Hopefully we also get to number one in the US. Very, very close. Once again, I think it's likely actually. And then next up we have Hong Kong, which is at number two right behind this Garena 5v5 game. I think it's kind of like a, a League of Legends style game on your phone, I, I believe. Never played it, but looks like it. So hopefully we beat that. And uh, also, once again, I feel like it's pretty likely that we'll get top grossing. Next up, we have Italy, which is currently at number five. Um, so, you know, this one's gonna be a little bit tougher behind Disney Plus Coin Master, which is I've been seeing ads everywhere for this game, and it, I don't know who made it. I mean, Moon Active, I guess, but these people must be raking in the dough right now, man. Like, I couldn't imagine how much money they're making. Anyways, Coin Master, Netflix, uh, Call of Duty Mobile, and of course, at number five, we have Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. Next up, we have Germany, which is currently at number three, once again, behind Tinder. Man, Tinder is just it's tough, man. They're... Uh, they're constantly in the top charts no matter what is happening. So we got Tinder, we got PUBG, and the number three is Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle in Germany. And next up we have Belgium. And this one always confuses me. All right, this one always confuses me because I was under the impression that Belgium had gotten rid of all in-game purchases or loot box style purchases. So how are they still ranking every single time in like, like on the stores? Like it makes no sense. I thought people couldn't buy anything in Belgium. I don't know, you guys can maybe explain it to me in the comments, but anyways, number five in Belgium, maybe we'll get to number one, who knows? And uh, next up we have Spain, which is at number four, and uh, oh, we're back to France. So basically, those are all the regions that I looked at that were pretty close, there might be a few others out there, but uh, the closest ones we have, of course, are uh, Germany at number three, we have uh, Hong Kong at number two, as well as the US at number two, and Portugal at number three, so they're pretty close too. And of course, France already at number one. So if things remain exactly the way they are, I think we can expect at least like seven to 14 stones, maybe if Bandai's feeling generous, 30. Um, I mean, look, if it's a normal banner, like just like a single regular celebration or campaign, there's a chance we might not get anything for hitting just one, um, hitting top grossing at one region, right? But since it's a dual Dokkan Fest, since it is considered kind of a bigger celebration, 
most of the time, Bandai does give out some kind of top grossing reward, even for just even for just one region. So I feel pretty safe about the um, assumption that we will be getting something. All right. Now, like I said, if we hit top grossing in two regions, three regions, then maybe we're looking at something like 14 stones, 30 stones, maybe even 50, but probably not likely. And uh, the last thing here, at the end here, I have France again, but this is for the Android store. And I just want to show you guys that things are not going so well on the Android side of things. Uh, for some reason, over the last couple of celebrations, or just like this year in general, Android hasn't been performing that well, man, because, I mean, if we're looking at France, even France is only at uh, number 29 in the Google Play Store. So I don't think we have to look at anything else really. Um, if France can't even break the top 20 with this banner, then it's not happening for pretty much any other region, right? So uh, we don't have to look at the, the Android side. It's not going well, but um, you know, things on the iOS side, on the iPhone side, looking way, way better. And that is today's update, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video hope you guys are excited for some kind of top grossing reward over the next couple of days maybe tomorrow maybe actually tomorrow's saturday right so probably not tomorrow i would say most likely it's going to be like on monday or somewhere sometime next week possibly but i do really very much expect something from bandai for uh this dual token fest so there we go thank you to france once again we appreciate you as always and hopefully a few other regions hit top grossing. I mean, if you guys are global players in Portugal or US or Hong Kong, uh, Italy a little bit less likely, but you know, still close. And uh, Germany, Belgium, Spain, uh, any of those regions, then maybe spend a little bit more and uh, help us get top grossing in those regions as well. I actually want explanation. So in the beginning of the video, I was like, yo, I don't understand why we're doing so well considering a lot of people are skipping, right? But one of the reasons is probably because there's a lot of good sales right now and people I think are buying up the sales to save for the five year anniversary as opposed to spending their stones on these banners. So that's probably why um, we're doing better than expected for top grossing considering how many people are saying they're skipping, right? So anyways, that is the video guys. Thank you so much for watching. I already went way too long. I do apologize for rambling and uh, as always, if you guys enjoyed today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that no hit that notification notification bell too. Why is that so hard for me to say right now? Hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here until next time. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.